to the next one. Right here. Okay, first order of business when you get into your stateroom is make sure you put a key card in this little slot here. If uh, you've not traveled overseas, a lot of places require you to do that. It's an energy saver so that if you're not in the room, um, you've got the key with you and they can save a little bit of energy um, with the power to the room. So that's one of the reasons for that. So don't forget that or you won't have power to the room. <laughs> You'll try to turn on lights, nothing's gonna happen. Okay, first thing you run into when you walk into the room, you've got three closet doors here. So first one on the end here is a full size closet. It's pretty wide and you've got uh, two life vests up there and two life life vests down here, life jackets. Um, and then we're storing some of our bags in here. So that's perfect for that. But if you needed to hang some things, you could very easily do that with your hangers right here. Now these, keep in mind, you're not gonna be able to take these. You can take this off of here and that's all well and good, but you won't be able to hang these anywhere but in this closet. Cause this is like, you know, that old style of the hotel room. Don't take our hangers situation. Next um, is this closet here. Again, it's a tall one, like the one next door with a shelf up above. And then this one here, we're using for all of our clothes. There's three shelves and then down here at the bottom, you, this is the bedding for um, the bunk beds, which I'll show you in a minute. But these shelves, we store our clothes here and if we need to, we can store some things here too. So it's actually quite a bit of storage. And then you've got a full length mirror right here on the door to this one. Now, before we head into the room, let's go ahead and take a look in the bathroom, yes? All right, so as we step in, one thing to always keep in mind when you're on a ship is there are gonna be a lot of lips like this in different areas. So this is the first one. You're gonna have to step up to get into the bathroom. And here is the shower. It's a little corner shower. It looks like there's plenty of space in here. Got a lip here, so that's gonna keep the water from hopefully just sloshing all over the place. And a handlebar here, which is nice and useful. And then if you want to dry some clothes, just pull that across and hook it into this side over here. Okay, so that's gonna be to dry your clothes or your swimsuits or whatever. You've got your bath gel and your shampoo already here, so just keep in mind if you need conditioner like me, you're gonna have to bring your own, which I've got. And then there's two knobs here for the shower. You've got one for the temperature and one for on and off. Make sure that you set those um, to the temperature that you want as you do that. Um, and you've got this shower bar, also, the shower head also moves up and down and it does come off up there as well. So that's really nice. One thing that's a little quirky though is this shower curtain. Sometimes when you're in the shower, this can blow out of here. So just know that that might happen <laughs> when you're in there. Next up is the commode. You're just gonna make sure that you push the button here and you're on a ship. So always making sure that you're not flushing anything other than toilet paper um, down the toilet. Okay, sink area, I absolutely love because it's huge, I feel like. Um, you've got space on both sides, um, nice big sink bowl. Which I, which I think is big for a cruise ship, obviously. Um, and then you've got storage underneath as well. We've got extra toilet paper and tissue paper here, um, a towel rack, and here we've got a uh, cups storage area, but then you've also got these with the little bars built in right here, which keep the stuff from falling out. You've got plenty, plenty of storage, not only up here, but also on the counter. So you actually have quite a bit in here. So that's a great bathroom. All right. Let's head into the room, guys. So, I love how much space is right here. So you've got not just your, your couch to sit in, but you've got a table here. Some of the newer ships, the rooms are narrower this way, but longer this way. I personally think this is really nice to have this much space going this way, because this is more of a, I can sit here and read and relax or whatever if I want to. Um, so you've got this table. Now, this is gonna turn into a bed and then another bed bunk is gonna come up from this little square spot here. So you can actually house four people in this room. So this is a bed, this is a bed, and then two people on that bed, all right? This area here is great also. You've got a bench, so you've got some place to sit. And then you've got your four drawers here, and you do have a refrigerator here where we're keeping 
our waters that we ordered ahead of time and they delivered those to our room. You can also purchase the ones that have been put into the room for you. All right, so this is a great mirror area. Look at this, they're super excited to see us. Welcome to the Carnival Magic. And then we've got, so here's the plug situation here. This is one of the downsides on the older ships is you've only got two 120s, okay? And one 230. Now see what I've done here is I've taken my converter that I always travel with and I'm using the 220 plug, as you can see here, and I put that right in there and then I have four USB spots and I can charge that way. So just keep that in mind. If you have a lot of USB things like we do, this is going to be perfect for you. And you can just order that off Amazon if you have any questions about it, ask me in the comments. Uh, you've also got some more storage over here as well as your safe if you need to throw some things in there and a little shelf underneath and some more shelves on that side. So much storage in this room, it kind of blows my mind really. It's like they want you to move in or something, I think I might. Um, okay, uh, so you saw the Xbox a minute ago. Now Rob has already attempted to hook that up to the TV, but it's showing this message that says, please check, please check your network, please contact front desk. So we're having a little bit of a snafu with that, but don't you worry because I am certain that Rob is going to try to figure out how to get that hooked up before we get out of here. Um, so he is going to mention in the comments if he gets it hooked up, he'll let you guys know in the comments. So make sure to watch out for that. Okay, so we've got the bed here, two uh, equal nightstands. So you've got a lamp here that's built into the nightstand. Go on and off, easy. And then you've got a little storage bin here. Again, tons and tons of storage, not to mention that you can store things underneath the bed as well. Great looking bed here, it looks comfortable. Same nightstand on this side. And then you also have this light switch here. You can turn off the room lights from here. The same lights that you turned in when you came in, you can turn them off right here. You get into bed and you're like, oh man, I don't wanna get out of bed to turn the lights off. Boom, you're easy breezy right there. Okay, the cream of the crap of this room is the balcony. So I like, uh, sometimes you've got, depending on what deck you're on, you've got two doors or you've got this beautiful window, which I really like to be able to look out and then you've got the door. So we're gonna open that and come on out. And take a look out here. So we've got two chairs out here and a nice little table. And then uh, one chair is stationary and one chair actually reclines. I'll show you. Okay, so you can just bring it forward and recline back if you want to sit out here and relax. So hopefully you guys have enjoyed this so far. We've got this really great view out here. Um, so we are really excited to take off. This is actually, come on in with me. This is actually the first sailing of the Carnival Magic since the shutdown. So I think everyone's super excited to be on here and to get going. So we're gonna bring you guys uh, along for more. We're gonna do a ship tour, so make sure to check back with us. Guys, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Give us a like on this video for more content like this. Leave us a comment if you have any questions about the room and we'll see you on the ship tour.